my initial idea for the project was I was we Mr. Dalman gave us a project to like do something big or small, and I wanted to, to uh, paint like a big forest, and then he kind of like pointed towards outside the window, and there was a log, and we're thinking about what we could do with the log, and then. Um, we originally wanted to put like spikes on it, like carve wooden spikes and somehow like attach those onto the log, but that would be kind of like tedious. And so then instead we decided to use rocks and kind of make like a stegosaurus type of thing. Um, and we used wooden pegs which we just cut from sticks that we found um, below the log and then we drilled holes and we just secured like the rocks in place with um, the pegs and we just created a row of them um, basically. Um, with this sign, we're just, Mr. Dalman got a piece of log and I'm just penciling in Spinal Tap, which is what we're calling um, the piece, and then just having my name written below. And then I'm just going to carve it into the log. So the reason why we called our piece Spinal Tap was because not only does it look like a stegosaurus, but we also wanted to kind of create some mysterious aspect between the name and the actual piece of art in which the viewer would contemplate um, the meaning of the art. So finishing this project was really important to me because I wanted to, uh, to create a piece of art which people would reflect upon and kind of take notice of and maybe even like inspire some people to use the environment as their own canvas and um, just really utilize what's around us and appreciate the things that surround us. And so now when all the parents come by to like pick up and drop off their children, they can pass by the piece of art and they can realize that art can be found not only in you know the art galleries downstairs, but also outside in the environment. Mm -hmm.